Hi everybody, so today's video is a what's in my carry-on bag video. So I travel a lot with my blogging. I am traveling back and forth from Ottawa to Toronto constantly. I am in Toronto, it feels like several times a month where I'm going to blogging events or visiting my sister or doing both. So I have really learned how to travel smartly and comfortably all while doing so with style. I wanted to focus on what I put in my carry-on bag to make the whole traveling process pretty bearable. Before I get started, I just wanted to thank all of you guys for tuning in again and a big hello to all of my new subscribers. I love having you guys here in my little corner of the internet. All right, let's dive right into this. For starters, the bag. I treated myself to this Louis Vuitton carry-all when I turned 40. I really wanted a brand new one, but the price I felt was just really, really expensive. Now, if you really, really love something and you feel you'll get a lot of use out of it, then go ahead, pay that. But I bought this bag pre-loved from one of my favorite online consignment sites, which is fashionfile.com. It was in pretty much mint condition. The only thing that was missing was the little golden lock that secures the two zipper pulls while you're traveling, but that's no big deal. I actually have spare locks from other Louis Vuitton pieces, or right, you can always, if that happens to you, you can always go to the Louis Vuitton store and buy another lock. Now, why did I want the Louis Vuitton carry-all? It's the perfect size, and it has two pockets on either end, which are really handy. I shove my phone in there and my boarding passes while I'm traveling. It's just super, super easy. Of note, this bag does not have a shoulder strap, so I try my best not to overstuff it and make it heavy. The bag itself is heavy, but overall I try to keep it manageable. Okay, so yes, that's the bag. I bought it pre-loved. It was about 600 American dollars. So I'm just gonna open it up here. And the first thing I have in this carry-all is my trusty phone. I don't leave home without it, obviously. It's pretty much my life. And this is the iPhone 8 Plus. I love the big size, mainly because I can read it. <laughs> Next up are my trusty eyeglasses. My vision has failed over the last year, so I picked these up recently. They're Francois Pinton glasses. He is the designer behind Audrey Hepburn's iconic sunglasses in Breakfast at Tiffany, and also made a lot of Jackie O's glasses. So if it's good enough for them, it's good enough for me. <laughs> Anyways, these are just very delicate, feminine tortoise shell frames. I'll give you guys a closer look. So here you go. I picked these frames because they're just really delicate and pretty, and the brown tortoiseshell goes with everything. I wear these glasses. They do not wear me. I really, really love them. And they're stylish, yet classic enough for me to wear for years. Okay, so the next two things that I'm going to show you guys in my carry-on bag are near and dear to my heart, because I am always cold. Well, it doesn't help that I live in Ottawa that's perpetually freezing, but yeah, I run cold, so I like to be cozy. I'm on the train a lot back and forth from Ottawa to Toronto, so I always pack my cashmere wrap. It's like a blanket scarf, and this is from Etujan Cashmere, and I love cashmere because it's a natural fiber that keeps you really nice and warm and snugly when you're cold, but also keeps you cool if, you're, if it's not so cold outside, you know what I mean? So this is like a perfect scarf for those summer nights that are a little chilly, and in the winter it is like a totally chic blanket scarf, it keeps you nice and warm, it's the perfect temperature regulator. So it's just lovely. It's in a soft dove gray. It has a beautiful fringe detail along the edges. And on the train, I just wrap it around myself like this, like a cozy blanket. It is so soft and wonderful. You can obviously use it as a scarf too. I wear it just about daily. It just looks so chic and cool with everything. The soft dove gray is the perfect neutral too, so it 
just looks fabulous with everything. I wear a lot of black and browns and camels and navies, so this color for me is fabulous. When I wear it as a blanket scarf, what I do is I take it by one corner, it's a big rectangle, and I shake it out so that it's nice and long, grab it like this, and I just wrap it around like so. And voila, you just have your beautiful chic scarf. You will see this all over my Instagram. I love it. It's warm, it's cozy, and it looks great. Sorry, I'm just uh, fiddling with it here. I absolutely love this. I also love to keep my hair tucked into it. I feel like it protects it a little bit. Ugh, fabulous. I love this scarf. It is my savior on the train. The next most important thing that I have in my carry-on bag are my cashmere socks. Like, I don't play, and I love luxury everything. So I snagged these cashmere socks. They're also from Atijan Cashmere, and they are in a really pretty oatmeal color here, and they're so soft. They are like warm hugs for your feet. I always heard this thing that if your feet are cold, your whole body is cold, and <laughs> that rings very true for me. So I'll wear these like, while I'm on the train or if I'm getting onto a plane, I will slip these on. I love, love, love these socks. Cashmere socks, like, I swear, it's just one of life's pleasures. So, just a little side note, Atujan Cashmere is sustainably sourced, cruelty-free cashmere, so I feel really great supporting this brand. It's also fabulous quality. The cashmere doesn't pill, it lasts a long time, and it's actually very moderately priced. So, for instance, I have a cashmere scarf from a designer brand, and that cost me $650, and it is a third the size of this blanket scarf that's also from Etugen. And the Etugen blanket scarves are only $125, and the quality is exactly the same. So. I love these. These are treasured pieces in my wardrobe and they are so warm. So warm. Love that. Okay, so next up are my headphones. They are fantastic. They are noise cancelling headphones. They are... I feel kind of cool when I wear them, like I'm a DJ. <laughs> But yeah, they are wireless, they save the day um, when the train or the plane gets a little loud. Fantastic. I like to listen to music while I'm on the train or the plane or whatever, so those are my saving grace. My trusty iPad, I will download movies off of either iTunes or Netflix, and I swear, when I have my iPad and I'm watching a movie, I, I feel like the trip goes by so much faster. I have a Louis Vuitton pochette and I just carry extra stuff in there like, what do I have? I have my vlogging camera. This is a Sony mirrorless camera. It's the Sony A6000. Excuse me, it is a Sony A5000 and it's got a flip up screen. And it took me a long time to love this camera, but I will admit I didn't really know how to use it, but it's really powerful, has a lot of great features, and it's fantastic for vlogging when I'm on these trips. And I have a pair of sunglasses in here. These are my Saint Laurent's. They're so extra, they're crazy. That's how they look like up close. It's all silver and gold glitter. Yeah, love it. <laughs> Uh, oh, I have another pair of sunglasses. These are Gucci, and they are like the quintessential sunglasses. I am lost without them. They look amazing, and they go with everything. These were money well spent. If I lose these, I will die. I love them. I have my wallet, another, God, I'm like a Louis Vuitton pig. This is a wallet that my husband got me. It was for an anniversary like 10 years ago or so. I love it. And uh, I feel like stuff Louis Vuitton made back then is way better quality than it is now. And uh, this looks brand new. Anyways, this is my wallet, my everyday wallet. I love it. Trusty keys. 
my five minute journal. I love this thing. When I have a quiet moment, I'll just jot down things that made me happy. This is super easy for people who want to journal, but don't have enough time to do it. It literally takes five minutes. So yeah, I think this keeps you honest. It also forces you to read what makes your day great and what makes you great as a person. And when you're feeling down, I know when I'm feeling down, I can go back to my entries and, and see that life really is good. I do really have it great. My life is awesome and I'm blessed, so I love this thing. I always carry a book with me when I'm traveling. Ryan got me for Christmas, The World of Style by Ami Song. She is one of my favorite, favorite, favorite bloggers. When I started blogging, I followed her really, really closely and this book is beautiful. So it's basically just her recounting her travels around the world beautifully shot. Uh, if there's one thing about Ami Song, girl can dress. She looks great. So this gives me tons of inspiration when I'm blogging or doing photo shoots. So lastly, I have an Away mini suitcase. So in this little mini suitcase, I carry all my toiletries that, ooh, I carry all my toiletries that I feel are like necessities when I'm traveling. So I have this Aesop, Resurrection Aromatique Hand Balm. It's lovely, it smells incredible. And then I've got this Tweezerman nail kit. It's a, called a mini rescue nail kit. It's got nippers in it, nail clippers, nail file, like some little pick thing to get dirt from underneath your nails. This is awesome. But if you're flying by plane, if you're taking a plane, you cannot bring this, they will confiscate it because it has all these sharp tools in it. So remember, trains, whatever, this is fine. Planes, not so much, okay? Advil, lifesaver, and like a billion lip glosses. I've got Too Faced Peach Lip Balm, Pat McGrath Labs Blitz Gold Lip Gloss, amazing, so, so pretty. Um, Eyeglass cleaner, sunglass cleaner, love it. Anastasia lip gloss in warm bronze, fabulous. Uh, I'm wearing that today over some other lipstick. Tom Ford lipstick in Adora, the most beautiful feminine color. Hand sanitizer, keep all those influenza cases away from you. <laughs> and more hand sanitizer. So that finishes off my what's in my carry-on bag video. I hope you found this interesting and or helpful. If you're traveling anytime soon, maybe this will help you pack smartly for your trip. If you're interested in any of Etujin's merchandise, it's all fabulous cashmere that is cruelty-free and sustainably sourced. I have a code for you guys to use. Use code STYLEDOM10 to get 10% off your purchase. The socks are absolutely heavenly. All of these things are really well priced too, so treat yourself. And if you have any questions or comments, please send them my way. You know I love hearing from you guys. So don't forget to subscribe to my channel, like this video if you enjoyed it, and check me out on Instagram. I'm at dominique.baker. I would love to see you guys following my antics. All right, bye for now, guys. I will catch you in the next video.